everybody. I love you. How's everybody doing? It's great to see you again. If I could see you. Um, I'm Joanne, and this is Joanne Ralston Art. And you are seeing this after I'm home from Wyoming on my trip. So I did this before I went. But anyway, I am working on a 20 by 20 gallery wrapped canvas, but it's the thinner one. It's not the big wide one. And um, I'm working with several different kinds of paint. And I am going to do, oh, what did he call it? It's a Nate Bright inspiration. The I had it in my head five minutes ago. Not asteroid. I can't think of it. It'll come to me, maybe at the end of the video. Anyway, I'm going to put you down to the canvas now and show you my paints and we'll get started. Thanks. Okay, hope everybody can see that. Um, this is my 20 by 20 canvas, gallery wrapped, um, but the thin sides, not the thick ones. Um, my base is going to be Amsterdam Oxide Black. And I've got it mixed up, I think, pretty good. Um, my colors on it um, I have ice blue by folk art and it's a beautiful 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 shiny light blue okay then my other color is amethyst and it's also a metallic by folk art and it's a gorgeous light purple color I wanted colors that will really pop out on a black canvas this is this little piggy submarine and it's a yellow and I wanted a good bright yellow and that pretty it just shimmers and then I have another metallic, and it's called Christmas Green. And it's a nice, kind of medium dark green. And these paints are thin, because I'm gonna be blowing them out. And then I wanted a dash of white and some shimmer pop in it. So this little piggy shimmer and it's a nice white shimmery color. I'm just kind of going to drizzle that in there. I'm not going to put a lot. I also want to go ahead and use my cell activators. This is Amsterdam Titanium White mixed with, oh, I'm getting low, Aussie Floetrol. One part paint. Three. I put three and a half to four parts Aussie Floetrol. I like it better. And same with the Amsterdam Oxide Black. And, um, but I want some cells in this. And then, of course, my good old-fashioned Deco Art 24 Karat Gold. I love this. I want to put a little bit around just to give some more shimmer. I want this to have some shimmer. I kind of wish I would have used a sparkly um, black. But let me get these out of the way so we can get our canvas covered. All right. Let's get the canvas covered now. Okay. Here we go. We have the canvas covered. And I just got hair on there. That's my puppies. I have been 
Shaving puppies today. Okay, we got our base on. Nebula. I remembered the word. Nebula. We're gonna do a nebula. We wanna start with the green. And we're just kinda gonna make a circle. And it doesn't have to be perfect. And let's see, what do I want next? Let's go with the light blue. Make sure I get enough paint. Um, then we'll go with the purple. Oh, these metallics are going to be cool. And then the yellow. And just a little bit more. Probably should have just poured it. This, this cup is hard to pour out of for some reason. All right, then our shimmer. Just kind of shimmer it all around. And then of course, favorite 24 karat gold got to have a little bit in there that looked like a lot but it's not really and then I'm gonna put a little bit of white cell activator Like I said, I do want to try to make some cells come in there, which it probably will with the metallics, but I'm going to be better safe than sorry. I want some pizzazz. All right, I'm going to put, since I forgot to put it down with the ring, I'm going to put some black on the outside to make sure that it's got enough to move. All right, let's torch that. If I can get my torch to work, I better be ordering me a new torch. These things don't last long. I advise you to order two and keep one in a box on hand. Come on. I see one bubble there, I just can't get popped. Where'd it go? There it goes. Okay. Now, the blow dryer. Prepare for some noise. Yeah. 
Yep, we're gonna have to put some more. Let's not muddy that up. All right. Let's try this again. This time I'm gonna put the black underneath. Paint than we did last time. Oh, I did not mean to get that in the middle, and I did it. And I got it over here. Take your finger, move it along, and move it out of there. And it's gone. All right, let's do this again. I'm not giving up. Let's try to pour it. have needed to water this paint down more. I thought I had it thin enough. It doesn't leave any kind of a mound or anything. Definitely got more paint this time. Oh, where's my cell activators? There they are. Joanne, it would help to open it. That really what I blew out's pretty. I just need it to blow out more. All right, let's try this again. Oh, let me put some more black in there. A little in the middle. Let's put some more around it. I want this baby to move. Here we go. Colors are beautiful. Oh, I would dip my blue dryer right in it. Messed my center up with the blow dryer. Let's see if we can get that out of there. Nice. Go back and paint over top of that. I don't want to 
want to go too much. I don't want to muddy my paint. But I want it bigger. Mr. Nate Bright, you do better than I do. And it's all in the consistency of paints. I just didn't have them thin enough. And that's exactly why it wouldn't blow out the way I wanted it to. And I may leave that in the center. It's kind of neat. I took my paint, my blow dryer, right through the paint. Just scooped it right in there. Well, we'll have to wait and see how this dries. I'm still tempted to do it again. To pull some more color back, because I had to blow out. But this is all shimmering. It is just shimmering. I don't know. What happened here? There. I see some cells. Oh, it's on its last leg. All right, there is my nebula. I will try that again and make my paints thinner. All right, let me bring you up the best I can. And try to get away from that glare. Look at those colors. Pretty cool, huh? There's my nebula. All right, let me set it back down. Oh, it moved a little bit. <sighs> oh, I like that green in there. The colors are really starting to appear, so I'm anxious to see how this dries. So make sure you stay tuned for dry results. They come in at the end. And let me say goodbye to you. I love you. You take care. Thank you so much for watching. I so greatly appreciate it. Um, I've got... 444 subscribers now, but all of them aren't watching. So, I need to get some more watching, and I need to get some more subscribers. So, if you know anybody that would like this, share it with them. Anyway, hit that thumbs up, and comment, and share, and if you're new, please consider subscribing. And um, take care, take care of you, take care of each other, and spread that love. We need more in this world, and spread the love of art. Thank you very much, and like I said, stay tuned for dry results. Bye-bye now. Okay, everybody. Here we are for dried results of the nebula. Ah, I remembered. <laughs> oh, guys, I have an off time pulling the words out of my head sometimes. I really like the reactions I got, and I like the way the colors showed up. I just wish 
you know, here it looks a little bit bright with the light, but without being right under the light, it's not real bright on this black, but it's still beautiful. Look at the edges there. And right here in the center is what I was talking about. It looks like a shooting star. And then this came down into it. But that's okay, it's pretty. But check it out. You can see all the colors, they really showed up. And once again, I don't know how or when I did it, but I put my finger in it. Must have been when I was propping it over there on the drying table on the things. And then I got this and it didn't come out real smooth black. So, but resining will fix that for sure. So anyway, I hope you like this video. I appreciate you being here. It's awesome when you come to watch. And when I say I love you guys, I mean it. I wouldn't be here if you weren't here. So, it's greatly, greatly, greatly appreciated. I'm kind of at a standstill now, stuck at 450 subscribers. My goal is a thousand, of course, but it's slow getting there, but it's worth the work. This gives me something to do every day. And once again, thank you. Please, if I haven't already said it, like, comment, share. If you're new, please consider subscribing. And everybody, take care. <laughs> My, I got made fun of. I got to tell you that. I got made fun of at Christina Welch's retreat. Miss Mona, Art Flow by Mo, she was imitating me and my gestures. She's, take care of you. <laughs> take care of each other. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> so she had a good time with that. But anyway, take care of you and take care of each other. And spread the love. Gosh, do we need it and spread the love of art. It's very therapeutic. And thanks again. Everybody take care now. Come back and see me. Bye-bye.